Are you taking ibuprofen or naproxen, otherwise known as Advil or Aleve, daily for pain and thinking that it's the same thing as taking Tylenol? It's not, and there's something really important that I want to tell you. Hello, my name is Lindsay Dixon, and I'm a registered pharmacist in Canada, and I help people with their health online through evidence-based information that is sometimes not accessible to the public, and I try to make it accessible. So I want to alert you to something that I've seen many people doing. So this here is acetaminophen. This is otherwise known as Tylenol. And this helps with pain and it's really good for things like joint pain, uh, sometimes muscle pain, and different forms of chronic pain. Now, this can be hard on your liver and the max dose for this is four grams a day. If you exceed four grams a day, you will be doing damage to your liver. This is very different from something like ibuprofen, which is known as a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medication. Now, this is not something that you should be taking daily unless your doctor has recommended it. And usually the doctor will only recommend something like this for short periods of time, say after an acute injury or a muscle tear or something like that. Why? Because one of the side effects of this type of medication, and I'm also including things like naproxen or diclofenac in here, is that this causes your stomach to produce excess stomach acid. When you take this over a long period of time, it increases that stomach acid, which increases your risk of developing a gastric or duodenal ulcer. What it also does is it affects the gut health or the bacteria that are in your gut when you take this and it adversely affects them. And so it's not something you wanna be taking over a long period of time. I've seen people taking ibuprofen over long periods of time and unfortunately it's available at big box stores in the 400 milligram strength, which is the extra strength capsule, which is really, really hard on your stomach. So if you're doing this daily and it's not under a physician's direction, you really should stop doing this and maybe try something like Tylenol and all or ask your pharmacist what would be best for you so you don't end up getting an ulcer and starting to get the symptoms of excess stomach acid production.